Let me see. Did I break it? Oh, a little key. Ah. Hello, everyone, and welcome once again to Silent Hill Alchemilla, where it's time to probe the apartment buildings and see what we find inside. Too bad I can't jump, otherwise I might be able to get up there. <laughs> I guess that's the point, isn't it? The whole point is that I can't get up there. Oh well. Maybe my guy is just the least athletic person on the planet. And can't even jump over a small obstacle. Locked, I need a key to open it. Well, at least we got a clue. I gotta be able to get in there somehow. Probably. I'm, I'm gonna assume. If they didn't intend for me to go in there, they probably would have just said something like the lock is broken or something, or like it doesn't have a door knob or something. Welcome. Welcome, we're locked. Wait, the hell of a welcome, Matt. That's something I really never really noticed before. I don't tend to notice things like this. The street is blocked, I need to find an alternate route. What? Okay then. What the hell? What was that all about? Locked. You locked and need a key. Right. Oh, both those are locked and need a key. Fair enough. Locked. Need a key. Locked. We well, guess locked, right? No. Right. This is the one I went before. You think I would remember things like that? I remember that I made the knife crack. Can't be opened. It can't be opened. Nothing can be opened around here except for this one door. And probably the other doors that I've opened. Not even gonna check the fridge. None of these cabinets. I mean, for all you know, there could be the MacGuffin inside there. The magical MacGuffin that makes all your dreams come true or some shit. You might have completely bypassed the way to get through this game. But why would you ever check? Because you're an idiot. Because you, you wouldn't be an idiot if you did that. You're an idiot because you won't check. Okay, that's great. What's in room number two? The lock is broken. See? Locked and need a key. See, that one said lock broken. That makes more sense. Because you can't. Right, God. That's probably tied to something I'd wager. Nothing more can fall through the chute is clogged, obviously. So we've got God, which is that weird symbol. It's hard to describe what it looks like. Uh, maybe two slings on opposite sides. Lock is broken. Lock is broken. Lock didn't need a key. This is the room I started from. Nope, it was not. Definitely not. Maybe I started from the first floor. No, I, I, I wouldn't be in. That's impossible. Because if I'd started from the first floor, I wouldn't have had to go up uh, some stairs on the outside just to get in. Unless that was like basement level or something. But Jimmy, for all I know, it could be. I don't know. I don't know any of these things. Wait. What do I have here? Now it is open. Okay. Something that wasn't open is now open, so... Lock is broken. I'm going to assume I was supposed to go this way. What the hell is this? Flesh. Okay, flesh, god, and something else. I don't know what I'm supposed to do here. It has to work now. Oh, I just had to do the two big ones, huh? Huh. Lock is broken. Lock is broken. And lock is broken. Wonderful. Anyway, what was fixed as a result of that? Oh, I can't even touch the small ones. I guess that made it a lot easier. I didn't even have to pick the right ones. You could literally only pick two of them and you can only do it once. Lock is broken, I can't open this door. I was about to say. That better not have been my one way out. Nope, um, I don't know where I'm going. But at least I accidentally solved, uh, something. I don't know what I solved, but I solved something. The lock is broken, I can't open this door. Great. I'm just gonna say broken. 
You know, like that um, one YouTuber, How the World Works. Broken. It's just broken, 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 broken. I feel guilty for some reason. I feel guilty for wanting to live. How dare I? There are some people who couldn't live. What? Oh, I see. It's probably in order of importance, so... I mean, flesh would be at the bottom, wouldn't it? I believe that is flesh. Maybe this? Or not. Um, this, 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 and this? Huh, nope. I'm gonna have to figure this out, though. I know it's flesh and God, I know those two. But if I can figure out the other two, I should be golden. Or at least try to figure out what the puzzle is. Locked, I need a key to open it, of course. The key's probably in that box. Because why wouldn't it be? Okay, I know flesh and God, I just need the... Literally anything else. Right. Wait, what the hell? Right, there we go, God. I knew that was God. Rep that represented God, it isn't really God. If that was God, I could ask God to help me. But it seems that God does not dwell in Silent Hill. That's why it may as well be called Hell. But not really. Only when it goes into the nightmare section of it. Lock is broken. That's great. Are any of these doors openable? I can't even say unlocked because sometimes the door is just stuck. Or the lock is broken. So it's not even necessarily locked. Then again, maybe they're dead bolted. Because, I mean, I do play Call of Cthulhu. Locked. Locked. I think this is the one where the door on the far end is openable. Unfortunately, I only know two of the symbols. And one of them I'm not even entirely sure about. Oh, dreams. Beautiful dream, awake unto me. So we've got dreams, flesh, and God. What would the fourth one be? Is there some kind of, um... Sta is there some kind of poem or something that would be connected to this? You know, like dreams, God, flesh, and something? That would tell me what order they're actually supposed to be in? Because this makes no sense. This tree is blocked. I need to find an alternate route. Well, I'm gonna figure out something. Hang tight real quick. Oh, maybe if I just check next to it. Man once had nothing but hatred and darkness. Pain permeated his existence. Then God was born. Born in that pain. Pain of a man and a woman who put their faith in the power of the sun. And so God came upon the earth and he gave law and order to his people. He gave them flesh, time, and death. Thus the people were happy for they knew the value of flesh and time. Time divided all into day and night. Night brought to man the realm of dreams and dreams they get. Okay, so it is, um... I'm gonna, I'm gonna assume the last one is pain. So pain, God, flesh, dreams. Pain, God, flesh, dreams. Okay. Pain, flesh, God, dreams. Or not. I have no idea. Maybe that's something else. So, um, God, flesh, dreams, and then whatever this is. Nope. Clearly I have it wrong. I have something wrong anyway. Maybe this? No, wait. God would go before dreams. I know that. God was born. Um, maybe I have it backwards. Uh, I do not know. Maybe it's this. This? What the hell? It wasn't selecting for a second. Oh, I see. I see. This is weird. Okay, here we go. I guess I just didn't do it properly. I guess I just wasn't pointing at it right. My bad. Finally got it. 
I feel guilty for some reason. How dare I want to save and preserve my life, should anything happen. I feel guilty for getting life insurance. Well, I guess I... I guess you could feel guilty if you got life insurance knowing you might die. Well, knowing you will die. Obviously, you get life insurance just in case you might die, but... Lock is broken. Well, I mean, I got some keys, so maybe the doors that were locked before are now within my grasp. That is always a possibility. And there weren't any doors that I could open on the second floor before. One key from the keychain fits. Bingo. Bingo, baby! Now, what could be in here? Is that a music box? Can't be open, can't be open. But at least this one allows me to peer inside of it. It's a bathroom. It doesn't look any different from a normal bathroom. A piano. Let's play some piano. Awesome. I'm so glad I came in here. Nice piano. That's piano. I wanted piano. Well, I guess some people don't under don't appreciate the beauty of piano. Door is stuck. Okay, here I am again. I can see myself clearly. This mirror isn't that broken. Or at least not so broken that I can't view myself in one of them at least. Heh. <sighs> That's great. Is there anything of worth in here though? I and mean, the piano is nice, or piano, or whatever you want to call it, but... All joking aside, there doesn't appear to be anything of actual worth in this place. You won't even open anything. No drawers, no cabinets, not even that briefcase over there. He won't even check anything. Is this guy? This this is a face that says, no, I don't want to check anything. That might be helpful. Why would I want to do that? Lock is broken. Well, anything that's just locked should be openable. Yes. Or I guess in this case, unlockable. What the hell, camera? I found tape inside the camera. The camera has a tag, apartment 306. Neat. I guess I better check that out then, huh? Teddy bear. And a baby doll again. Just an old toy. That's crying audibly. Yeah, just an old toy, all right. I mean, maybe it's one of those toys that have audio capabilities, but on its own? Without anyone to click on it? Also, why are these chains fixated into place? I guess it's because it's Half-Life 2, but, uh, I mean, it's a source engine, but you'd think they'd be able to move around or something. Oh, well. At least I found a clue. Oh, okay. Just an old toy? Well, in this case, you'd be right. Thought I heard something rattle. Oh, okay. I guess there's nothing more for me in here. Let's go to apartment 306. Quickly. Don't waste any time, my man. 306, 306, let's go. Let's pick up the pace, buddy boy. Now, what could be up here? One key from the keychain fits, 303. It's not 306, but it'll do. Happy birthday. What the hell? You hear that? I must be peering into the past. When they were celebrating someone's birthday. Some kind of notch here. Oh, I see. I thought he was talking about the can for some reason. Can't be opened. Can't be opened. Okay. I guess I need to find some key and, well, some kind of artifact and shove it in there. Maybe I'll find it at 306, which is where I'm supposed to go. Oh, shit. Maybe I should turn that off. This looks like a photo development lab. I don't know how to use this equipment. You can learn, bitch. I don't know how to use this equipment. What did we just, what did I just say? I don't know what this is used for. Well, your ignorance is about to get you killed. I found an empty bottle. That's great. What the hell? 
Does that say green tea? Why, what is there tea doing in the bathroom? I have a bottle full of water. Awesome. What are you supposed to use that for? Because I have no earthly idea. Door's stuck. Oh, it's stuck. Hmm, won't budge. Do you know how to use the equipment now that you have a bottle of water? Whatever, mate. I'm just gonna get the hell out of here then. Probably need to figure out how to use that equipment. At least I'm closer to solving this out. Figuring this out. This door was already unlocked, which meant that it was already that door that I could go to before, so... There's no reason to go in there again. Locked, I need a key to open it. I guess that... I guess, though, that keychain is not absolute. It doesn't have a key to everything, unfortunately. You prick. Oh well, it's, it's what it is. It's, it's whatever, man. Let's just get the hell out of here already. That'll be delightful, I think. Most acceptable. Now then. Where are your deep, dark secrets, huh? Huh, buddy boy? Lock is broken. Awesome. Oh, right. This area again. Right. Hmm. I can't imagine that bottle of water would fit in that indent from before. I mean, it might. You never know. But I would say the odds are against it, maybe. What would I need a bottle of water for? Beats the hell out of me. I was just in here. Funny story, that. Roy. 203. Wait a minute. This is, uh, 206. This isn't the same one as before. This is, um... This is where I found the camera for the first time. Yeah. I can't imagine I need a bottle of water for anything in here, either. This area was probably just to get that... Uh, film. Why does it look like it's got some blood in it? I probably shouldn't be questioning things like that. For the sake of my sanity. For real, bro. Oh! I go in here. Sweet. What's in here? Telephone! Hello? Hello, hello? Um, if you're hearing this, this is a really bad reference to Five Nights at Freddy's. I should probably stop before I embarrass myself further. So, yeah. What the? Can I call someone? 911. Hunter County 911, where is your emergency? Uh, my house. What's the address? 152 River Creek Lane. Okay, what's the emergency? Uh, I just killed my mom and my sister. What? I just killed my mom and my sister. You just killed your mother and your sister? How did you do that? Uh, I shot him with a, uh, 22 revolver. I'm glad I punched that in. I honestly didn't even mean to have anything happen. I just wanted to see, well, if anything would happen if I just typed in 911. That wasn't what I was expecting, to say the least. Okay, let's just get the hell out of here. The deepest lore. Lock is broken. So many broken locks around here. If I find the landlord, I'll smack them upside the head. Irresponsible. Irresponsible, I tells you. On all your locks to get broken. Although, the, although in this place, the landlord is probably Satan or something. So, maybe I shouldn't. Maybe I shouldn't be picking fights with the devil. Yeah, who am I kid? That guy sucks. Anyway. Okay, let's see if I can do anything about this. There's some kind of notch here. Uh, okay. 
I guess that's not it. That's not the answer. So what do I use a bottle of water for? I don't know what I would use a bottle of water for. It's just weird. Let's see if there's anything on the first floor, I guess. I've already tried the second and third floor. And there's just uh, stuff blocking anything else, so it's not like I can do anything with that. Anything in here that could be used for water? Can't be opened, obviously. They're boarded up tight. You're right. That's lovely. Anyway. Oh, this place is quite empty now. Another person has left and simply disappeared. It frightens me. Something is wrong with this town. On my tenants, only old Andy remains. He doesn't want to abandon the town. He loves to tend to his look store. Although he hasn't had a visitor for quite a while now, unfortunately he doesn't have any other place to go, nor do I for that matter. I fear we will die here of old age and no one will even know. I suppose there's no reason to keep the apartment keys in their case anymore. I'll hide them in wardrobe. I also can't seem to find the key to the main entrance. I probably lost it when I was last with Andy. Well, where the hell were you with Andy? Okay, um, I'll hide, I'll hide them in the wardrobe. Ah, the apartment keys, right. Well, I found them, so that's good. Oh, I see. Are these where all the keys were used for? Yeah, I guess it doesn't matter now because I pretty much opened all the keys that can. I've opened all the doors with keys that can be opened. I'm still wondering what I'm gonna use a bottle of water though. That's confusing the hell out of me. A plant? Maybe that? Who am I kidding? Locked, I need a key to open it. And I do not have the key. Sadly. So maybe I ought to be saying hang tight real quick. Oh, I found a new door, so that's something. Let's see what's in here. Maybe something I can use water on, hopefully. Maybe this plant? No, the other one didn't need any, so why would I think this one's any different? The tap is rusty. Okay then, is that a clue? I do not know, but I must find something. Dear Elizabeth, I can't imagine life without you. I love you. My heart beats only for you, and I will wait for you forever. My room is always open to you. Call me and the door will be unlocked. My number is 555-4584. Okay. 4584. I only need to remember those. 4584. 4584. 4584. 4584. 4584. 4584. 4584. Where's that phone? I need to find it. Before I forget. 4584. Lock is broken, of course. Where's that damn phone. Ring, 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 ring. 4584. I have to keep saying it over and over again. There we go. Come on. 5 4584. 555 is the area code used by Hollywood for fictional phone numbers. Nobody answered. Wait, what? I did do the right number, didn't I? What? What the frick? Okay, it's not returning to its proper position, so I have to assume that it worked. I know I didn't forget the number. It's just 4584 plus the Hollywood area code number 555. That number is basically reserved for Hollywood. Nobody can have that number, that area code for real. It doesn't exist. That's to make sure that when they have a fictitious phone number, it doesn't accidentally call anyone, you know? Tap is rusty again. Okay, um, call me and my door will be unlocked. Yeah, it is 4584. I knew it. What's this? The locked box. Okay, then. Awesome. 
What am I supposed to do with this? Shove it down someone's throat? And watch them, uh, choke on it? Obviously that was a joke. I am legally obligated to say that is a joke. Not really. But I'm going to say that anyway as part of a joke. Ha ha ha. I know, it's lame. I know I should be embarrassed. Yeah, it's not going back. So, if I was a door, what would be opened? I guess I gotta come through all of them now. Just to see if any of them opened. Lock is broken. Lock is broken. Obviously, I've been through this one already. Frick. Really sucks having to go through each one of them individually. Have I been through this one before? Yep, I'm pretty sure that's the one I went through already. Twice now. Yep. Okay, then. There's obviously nothing in the wardrobe, and this door is stuck. So there's nothing for me in there, either. I guess I'll go down or upstairs. It doesn't really matter which. Maybe on the first floor. I should start at the bottom and work my way up. Even though it really doesn't matter in the slightest. Well, it kind of does because this door, this floor has far less doors on it, so, um, might work. Locked. I need a key. Okay, so nothing down here opened. Let's try the third floor then. There's bound to be something somewhere at some point in time. Then again, that's probably pretty obvious, isn't it? Give me the save point. Thank you. I feel guilty for some reason. Oh, well, what do you know? Ooh, darkness. That's why. It was darkness, not pain. Idiot. Locked. Need a key. I've been in here before, I believe. Maybe not, because this looks different. Oh, I see. There's a phone ringing. Well. It's this number. Yeah, sounds about right. What the hell was that indeed? I agree, what the hell was that? Fuck. Get back in there. Thank you. Why's the lamp on its side? Well, knocked over anyway. Mostly on its side. Ooh, basket of fruit. You know, it'd be better? Act an actual basket of fruit. But then again, it would probably be rotten because we're in Silent Hill. AKA hell. What the hell? What was that sound? Obviously, there's something preventing me from getting in the tub. The tab is rusty. Oh, I need a key to the box. Awesome. Well, I mean, I just straight up picked up a locked box before. I just pick up this one, too? Maybe? Or no? Is that a knife? Can I grab the knife to defend myself with? Just saying, it would, it would make me feel a lot better if I had something to defend myself with, but, you know, can't do that. Was there any point for me going in this room at all? Because there doesn't appear to be anything in here. Of value. I mean, yeah, there's a locked box in here. whoop de doo I can come back later and maybe attempt to lo unlock it, but... Right now, um, all I've got is a dead end. I've got no leads at all. I would fast forward again, but it's nearly, nearly the end of the Let's Play as is. And I don't want to fast forward again. I think I've done that enough. All I've got is a bottle of water. And film. That I apparently don't know how to process because my guy's kind of an idiot. Hate to say it. Wait a minute. Tope? Paramate. Is that the drug that Kaufman gave Lisa in Silent Hill 1? I don't know if that's a reference to that or not. I don't know the name of... I don't remember the name of her medication. He was basically getting them all hooked on that stuff. On some kind of medication. It was basically allowing him to have control over them. Because they'd have to work for him to be able to afford that medication. And if they stopped, they'd get, they'd suffer from extreme withdrawal. If I drop from this height, it would, drop that box from this height, it would break. 
Oh, okay. Wait. From what? Oh, okay. Here we go. No, wait, never mind. From what height? What are you talking about? I can't even get out there. You talking about the garbage chute? Maybe the garbage chute. Let's see about that. I mean, my, my time is up, but whatever. Let's just go see. I just want to check it out, see if anything can be done about this. Let's try this. Bingo. And of course, the second floor has uh, garbage blocking it, so it can't go any further down than that. So, before I end this video, let's just see what occurs from this. I may as well make a little bit more progress than I would normally. It seems that strafe running does not help me. Real shame, isn't it? Oh, I see. Did I break it? Oh, a little key. Awesome! So, I'm gonna have to figure out what this goes into in the next video, won't I? So, that's gonna have to be it for now. Maybe it's that other key. That other box, I mean. That is gonna have to be it for now. Thank you so much for tuning in with me. Make sure to spread this video around like puzzles. And I will see you next time. Now go out there and capitalize on life. Peace out, have a good one, and have a nice and pleasant day. I'm definitely not trying to stall for time, but it's not working anyway. See you later. If you enjoyed the content and want to stay up to date, I upload 10 a.m. and 2 p.m. Eastern Standard Time every single day. You can also subscribe and hit the bell icon or just check out the end screens right here.